Okay, here's another workout. Get your combat swimmer stroke a little faster. This one, however, is you repeat it 10 times. You do 50 freestyle at 8 to 10 strokes per breath, followed by a 50 combat swimmer stroke, trying to maintain your goal pace, but trying to catch your breath also from that 50 meter freestyle 8 to 10 breath holds, or 8 to 10 strokes per breath. Um, this one right here, you repeat it 10 times, so that comes out to 1,000 meters. Throw in a 500-yard warm-up, 500-yard cool-down, and you got yourself a nice little 2,000-meter workout. Here you go. So here's how it looks. He's just doing a freestyle. Notice how many strokes he breathes. Looks like he is on like an 8-stroke count again. Once again, you can do flip turns here if you want. I find it takes a stroke a breath away so uh, makes it a little harder if you do decide to do flip turns don't have to but uh, just makes the workout just a little harder he's on six to eight strokes per breath right now I, I'd recommend going eight to ten look I got a little extra breath there <clears throat> now let's see combat summer stroke boom and he's keeping his pace trying to keep it about 40 42 seconds per 50. That'll get him a seven, just under seven minute pace. There's two strokes, nice long strokes, three strokes. The, the goal is to get a little winded from the freestyle and hit these combat swimmer stroke intervals at your goal pace. So you're kind of resting, so to speak, with the combat swimmer stroke. So you turn this combat swimmer stroke into a catch your breath set so to speak with the hard freestyle and that is it do that 10 times and you got yourself a little workout to make you a little faster with your combat swimmer stroke but the key is if you want to swim faster you have to swim faster meaning if you want a seven minute swim you got to try to push your pace so you're at 45 second 50 yard swims or a minute and a half, roughly, and that'll get you a 730. So if you want a seven minute, you got to go 42 seconds. So that's the rule. Hit it.